Dribbling behind your back is a great way to protect the ball from defenders while dribbling. This iSport lesson breaks down a sequential series of drills that will improve your behind the back dribble. These drills get increasingly difficult, so it's a good idea to go through them in the order they're shown here. To begin the first drill, the back bounce, stand in the athletic position with your head up, knees bent, chest forward, shoulders square, and hips bent forward. While crouching, dribble the ball to your side twice to gain control of it, and then send it behind your back on the third dribble. Catch the ball in your opposite hand, dribble it again twice to gain control, and send it behind your back on the third dribble to your first hand. Once you're comfortable with this motion, don't take so many side dribbles between each behind the back dribble. Also, hop off the ground very slightly and land on the balls of your feet each time you send the ball behind your back. Continue this drill for as long as you can, or for a set number of repetitions or period of time. For this next drill, called the power round, begin on the sideline and stand in the athletic position. Move up court at a slight angle. As you do, take three dribbles with your right hand. The first two should be to the right side of your body, and the third one should send the ball behind your back. Square up your feet as you send the ball behind your back. Using a small hop and landing on the balls of your feet is the easiest way to do this. Push off your right foot and cut to your left as you catch the ball in your left hand. Once you have the ball in your left hand, again, dribble three times, repeating the other steps. Here's a review of these drills. The back bounce focuses on the hand movements needed to dribble behind your back. Dribble twice, then send the ball from one hand to the other behind your back. Once your other hand gets the ball, dribble twice again and send it back to the first hand behind your back. The power round has you dribble behind your back while changing directions. Start by moving forward, dribbling three times. On the third dribble, send the ball behind your back to your other hand. As you make a behind the back dribble, push off the foot that's closest to the ball. If the ball is coming to your left hand, push off your left foot.